station, Houston on two for Jeff. Hi, Jessica. Yeah, Jeff, unfortunately, we're going to have to stand down with the beam operations today. We've been assessing all the parameters here from the ground, and due to our set of no-go conditions and not seeing any noticeable movement, we're going to have to reassess further from here. So we have a couple of actions for you to take to get us in a, in a good position for that. First of all, we'll need you to cap the ISA sample port. Complete. Okay, great. That will get us in a good config, and then you can stop recording then if you haven't already. We may later on, we'll get back to you, but we may have you swap out those multimeters. And then just to give you a big picture, we're hoping to resume with inflation tomorrow during orbit one, but we'll have a status for you guys in evening DPC with follow-up there. Okay, I understand. And uh, just... Uh, I took the initiative since uh, the uh, controller is powered off, the KU uh, power supply I powered off, and because we have a lot of potential energy on the other side here, I chose to drag that thing back into node 3. So I'm going to leave it in node 3 so we don't have a drag through, if you concur. Okay, Jeff, good move. We concur with that. Thanks for all of your patience today, and we'll hope for better luck tomorrow. Well, these are the kinds of things the team is uh, up for the challenge for. It's, uh, it's space business. So uh, thank you all for your patience. Space.com.